Hey there, uh, welcome, and uh, why don't you join me in the reading of Psalm 136. Oh, give thanks to the Lord, for he is good, for his mercy endures forever. Oh, give thanks to the God of gods, for his mercy endures forever. Oh, give thanks to the Lord of lords, for his mercy endures forever. To him alone, who, excuse me, to him who alone does great wonders, for his mercy endures forever. To him who by wisdom made the heavens, for his mercy endures forever. To him who laid out the earth above the waters, for his mercy endures forever. For him who made great lights, for his mercy endures forever. The sun to rule by day, for his mercy endures forever. The moon and the stars to rule by night, for his mercy endures forever. To him who struck Egypt in their firstborn, for his mercy endures forever. And brought out Israel from among them, for his mercy endures forever. With a strong hand and with an outstretched arm, his mercy endures forever. To him who divided the Red Sea in two, for his mercy endures forever. And made Israel pass through the midst of it, for his mercy endures forever. But overthrew Pharaoh and his army in the, in the Red Sea, for his mercy endures forever. To him who led his people through the wilderness, for his mercy endures forever. To him who struck down great kings, for his mercy endures forever. And slew famous kings, for his mercy endures forever. Sihon, king of Amorites, for his mercy endures forever. And Og, king of Bashan, for his mercy endures forever. And gave their land as a heritage, for his mercy endures forever. A heritage to Israel, his, his servant, for his mercy endures forever. Who remembered, on, uh, who remembered us in our lowly state, for his mercy endured forever. And rescued us from our enemies, for his mercy endures forever. Who gives food to, to all flesh, for his mercy endures forever. Oh, give thanks to the God of heavens, for his mercy endures forever. Amen, amen, amen. Yahweh is not a God of yesterday. Uh, he is a God of today. He is a God uh, of tomorrow. And, and when he was creating all the goodness, uh, when he was providing uh, for Israel, when he was providing for his followers, uh, it is not just reserved for the times of past. He is the God of today uh, and he is the God of tomorrow. And I encourage you this week, I encourage you right now to, to pause and to give thanks to the Lord for his, many, for his many blessings. I encourage you to take over the next few moments, just think of 10 things, 10 blessings, 10 ways that you are thankful to God uh, in this season right now. <clears throat> and give thanks to him and to give him proper praise for, for providing for you. I understand that our world may appear to be ever-changing. I, I, I'm living in that same world with you. Uh, but I want you to know this truth. The Lord's mercy, the Lord's love endures forever. And may you hold on to that truth. May you be encouraged by that truth. And may you proclaim that truth uh, as you think of just a handful of things that you are, are grateful to God for during this season. God bless you. And I hope to see you soon.